the formidable robot. As the shadows lengthened over the quaint streets of Weatherfield, I found myself standing outside the imposing mansion of Jonathan Blackwood, the enigmatic writer behind the lost episode of Coronation Street. With each step closer to his front door, a sense of dread gnawed at my insides, but I knew that confronting him was the only way to unravel the mysteries that had haunted me for so long. The door creaked open, revealing a dimly lit foyer adorned with antique furnishings and fading photographs. Jonathan Blackwood stood before me, his piercing gaze locking onto mine with a mixture of curiosity and apprehension. I've been expecting you, he said, his voice smooth as silk yet tinged with an underlying tension. Without preamble, I delved into the heart of the matter, demanding answers to the questions that had plagued my thoughts since that fateful day I first laid eyes on the lost episode. Why did you create the lost episode? What were you hoping to achieve? I pressed, my voice trembling with a mixture of fear and determination. Jonathan's lips curled into a wry smile as he motioned for me to take a seat in the ornate armchair opposite him. Ah, uh, the eternal quest for truth. He mused, his eyes glittering with a hint of madness. Coronation Street was more than just a television show to me. It was a canvas upon which I could paint the darker shades of human existence. He spoke of his obsession with the occult, of his belief that hidden within the mundane routines of everyday life lay a world of untold horrors waiting to be unleashed. I wanted to peel back the layers of reality and expose the true nature of existence. Jonathan explained, his voice growing more animated with each passing moment. The lost episode was my attempt to bridge the gap between the ordinary and the extraordinary to delve into the depths of the human psyche and emerge with something truly profound. But as Jonathan spoke, a chill swept through the room, casting a pall over our conversation. It was as if the very walls of his mansion were alive with whispered secrets, urging me to flee before it was too late. What happened on the set of the lost episode? I demanded, my heart pounding in my chest. Jonathan's expression darkened, his eyes narrowing into slits as he recounted the events that had unfolded during the filming of Coronation Street's darkest hour. Strange occurrences plagued us from the very beginning. He confessed, his voice barely above a whisper. It was as if the lines between fiction and reality had blurred, and we were mere puppets dancing to the tune of forces beyond our comprehension. He spoke of unexplained accidents, of actors vanishing into thin air, their screams echoing through the empty corridors of the studio late into the night. And Ina Sharples. I interjected, my voice barely a whisper. Jonathan's gaze turned icy cold as he spoke of the character at the center of it all, her fate sealed by forces beyond his control. Ina Sharples was a sacrifice. He admitted, his words hanging heavy in the air. A pawn in a game much larger than any of us could ever imagine. As I listened to Jonathan's chilling confession, I realized that the truth behind the lost episode was far more terrifying than I had ever dared to imagine. And as I stumbled out of his mansion, haunted by the echoes of his words, I couldn't help but wonder what other horrors lay hidden within the dark recesses of Coronation Street, waiting to be unearthed. But one thing was certain. The loose ends of this twisted tale would never truly be tied, leaving behind a legacy of fear and uncertainty that would linger for generations to come. As I walked away from Jonathan Blackwood's mansion, the shadows of the night enveloping me like a shroud, I couldn't shake the feeling that I had only scratched the surface of the darkness that lurked within the heart of Weatherfield. And as I glanced back at the mansion one final time, I knew that some mysteries were best left unsolved, lest they consume us all. The story of the lost episode of Coronation Street may have come to an end, but the nightmares it inspired would live on, forever haunting the minds of those who dared to seek the truth.